66 South Florida tonight. It is a liquid that miraculously grows fuller eyelashes for women. It's easy to use and one of the hottest cosmetic enhancements around. Health reporter Diana Gonzalez shows us how it works and why there's some concern over a possible risk. How would you like long, thick lashes like these? This was the before and this is today. Oh my goodness. It's as easy as applying eyeliner, according to Dr. Alan Bauman. The treatment is an eyelash medication that you put directly on the lid that grows the eyelashes longer and thicker. Revitalash is the product Lauren Morris has been using for the past four months. It's just wow, I mean, there's a huge difference. I notice that their eyelashes are longer and that there's like more of them and there are, there's more volume, they seem a little denser. There are several similar products. The FDA recently warned consumers about one of them. Age Intervention Eyelash by Jan Marini could damage the eye because it contains bimatoprost, an active ingredient in a drug used to treat an eye disease. This was originally discovered through ophthalmologists who, in treating acute glaucoma, used intraocular drops and noticed that the lashes on the side that they were using the drops grew much, much longer, much thicker. Jan Marini says its product now on the market has been reformulated. Quote, we replaced the prostaglandin analog in our discontinued age intervention eyelash product with another. Because this medication is associated with commercially available eye drops that are placed in the eye, it can cause serious problems like inflammation. I would not put anything on the outside on my eyelashes unless I knew exactly what I was getting. Revitalash also contains a similar ingredient and warns not to get the product in the eye and that it may cause redness or irritation. In fact, the executive director of Dr. Bauman's medical group had to stop using it. She liked what it did for her lashes. But then I, I started getting pains, actually acute pains in my eyes. Some patients do find uh, that they may um, have some tearing of the eye, maybe because they're getting the medication into the eye or using too much, um, but that's very few and far between. This is a photo of Dr. Bauman's own wife who tried it on one eye for 12 weeks with great results and no problems. The FDA won't say whether it's investigating all so-called eyelash conditioners and their claims. Meanwhile, business is booming. The cost of this and other similar products between $140 to $160 for a tube that lasts three to four months. Diana Gonzalez, South Florida Tonight.